Well, 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 and if it isn't I, the guy who made a video that went really popular and then all of a sudden dropped off the face of the earth. <laughs> gone completely. Where did he go? Who knows. But one thing about this guy is he said he was going to make a video game and some people were looking forward to that. <coughs> Unfortunately that video game never came. But here I am now. Motivated. That 3 a.m. motivation has stayed with me. And if you are so kind, fair watcher of this video, you are going to come along on a journey with me as I embark on a great mission to figure out how the hell to make a video game without going to college. Let's get this shit. Here we are in Blender, and I already want to die. As you can tell from my mouse and how I'm fumbling around, I have no idea what the hell I'm doing. But that's alright, because that's all a part of the learning process. You gotta fall a million times to learn how to walk. At least in this case, right? I don't know why, but this music just goes hard whenever I do stuff. Just listen to a bit of this crap. Now you guys may be wondering, what the hell am I doing? Like, these are just boxes, they're squares. Well, see, I learned a really neat trick when I was, like, learning how to do Blender, maybe, if, like, four months ago. So, you're about to see. Now, that's what I call a perfect form, a beautiful human body. I actually had no clue what I was making when I was doing this, so I kind of went off rails after this. So I really need you guys to, like, prepare yourselves for what you're about to see. I am not gonna lie, when I first saw this in my head, when I was thinking, what am I gonna make? Yes, let's make a human. A little chibi human. But then it kind of went off rails when I started making this. I'm like, you know what? You know what? I know exactly what I'm gonna make. I drew this on paper once, and this is what that looks like. I'll have to admit, I can't draw for shit. And I'm gonna have to admit, this 3D model looks like shit, but that's okay. Because I need it to look like shit. I'm not going for some crazy, I'm going to spend 50 years on this one model. No, I'm trying to get some done and out in like a year. Texturing is the reason I gave up on this in the first place. I'm not going to lie to you guys. Oh my god, that voice crack. Lord have mercy. I'm not going to lie to you guys. Texturing is the reason I quit this shit. I'm like, dude, it's just so much. I can't. I can't compete, but then I learned a neat trick, and the neat trick that I learned is that there's this auto unpack texturing thing that like separates all the things like, you know, by a good amount. Whenever I untextured stuff, everything was just clumped together and it was the most annoying thing ever. The, the little tutorial I flashed on the screen, that's the tutorial I was using to learn how to do texturing and shit. And it was kind of pissing me off because I couldn't find out or how to figure out how to, like, add the texture. But, like, eventually I got around to it. And, man, it didn't turn out any way how I thought it was in my head. Oh, yeah, Mr. Krabs. <laughs> Do you need it, Mr. Krabs? Because I sure as hell don't. This thing came out fugly. But... I needed to come out fugly because in my head it's this nasty grotesque thing right I just kind of wish it didn't look like a really gross duck it looks like a duck so I'm just like uh it, it doesn't look it was supposed to look fleshy but it doesn't look fleshy it looks like a nasty duck I don't know I see a duck maybe you guys will see something else I named this monstrosity Cretan and he is going to be one of many variants that I envision in my head that I need to, you know, make and all this other crap, right? Maybe this guy will be like a little easter egg, like my very first fucking enemy 3D model, you know what I mean? Just, <laughs> I don't know, some, some, man, some. If you made it to the end of the video, thank you so much. I really do appreciate this, man. If you're going to be coming along on this journey with me, I appreciate it even more. I'll be seeing you all in the next video. Later.